I had a plan to ask a girl to the prom. Yeah. Then I had heard that there was a girl that was going to ask me to the prom. Yeah. Different girl. Yeah. Turns out that while I was trying to potentially avoid this girl, that other girl is trying to avoid me because I'm no catch. Right. So I finally got an opportunity to ask, and there was a very long silence. Yeah. To a point where I thought, I'm going to ask again. Maybe she didn't hear me. So I <laughs> asked again. And then she said, no, I heard you. I'm just thinking. So it was oh. followed by more silence. Yeah. But then she responded with, I guess so. Wow. Is that risk management? It's a deeply touching story. Yeah. And I think we should work through it. Okay. From her perspective, she was, I think, implicitly, Chris, and I hope I'm not breaking any news to you, yeah. but, you know, she was basically deciding, should I settle? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Sure. And, or should I wait? Should I wait? Maybe there's a better offer coming, or should I settle for Chris? Yeah. And I'm sorry, Chris, this is, I know, I, don't, I know you haven't quite come to terms fully with this experience, but this young woman in your life basically yeah. decided, yeah, I'll settle, which is kind of like a, it's yeah. an optimal stopping problem, which we see in finance, and it has a lot to do with kind of optionality. She gave up a lot of optionality. Yeah. She gave up the optionality to wait. Yeah. And so she surrendered her options. And now, of course, you're married and have three kids, and it's a great yeah. story. It's a, it's a great story. Anyway, <laughs> I just wanted to let that sit a little longer.